my gosh. Sigh. I have this big project on the French Revolution, but how am I supposed to do it if I don't even know how it started? Um... Where are the French Revolution books? Does this have anything to do with it? <coughs> As an intellectual, I have all the knowledge you need for what you need to know on the French Revolution. <laughs> to, start, <laughs> to start things off. So, to start things off, the French Revolution was a time period of new beginnings. French citizens rioted against the absolute monarchy and feudal systems and uprooted institutions and that have been known to... France for centuries. The three main causes were related to economical, political, and social issues. First, let's discuss the economical causes. Once upon a time, there was a king, King Louis XVI. He succeeded worse kings before him, such as King Louis XIV and King Louis XV, who ruled with absolute power and led France into more debt. They tried to stop the national debt by imposing taxes on the commoners and peasants. Their impact on France hurt the people greatly. Peasants were then forced to rent their land out to the nobility. By the work of the three estates, there was a small chance to reverse the downward spiral of France. The three estates organized meetings to talk about laws and reforms to present to the king. The third estate specifically fought for equal representation or voting by head to stop the spiral and to not put all of the work on the commoners. With these economic downfall, bad social conditions, and a terrible political structure would end France's story with the French Revolution.